Hello everyone. Today we make tofu at home. Tofu is my favorite ingredient, but in the past two months it was quite hard to buy, so I made a lot of batches myself. Follow my steps, and you will find that making tofu at home is so easy. The first step of homemade tofu is to make soy milk. I have already soaked the beans for four hours. Then transfer the beans to a blender, add water, blend well, and strain the mixture to get soy milk. I use around three cups of soy bean this time and get five liters of. Soy milk at the end. Don't forget to wash the pump, so we can get as much soy milk as possible. Mix 3 tablespoons of rice vinegar with 1 cup of water. Heat the soy milk to a boiling and during the process, remember to stir from time to time to avoid sticky button. Watch very carefully because the soy milk can overflow very quickly. Once the soy milk starts to boil, slow down your fire and let it swim here for one minute. Then remove from heat and rest for two to three minutes. The temperature of the soy milk will drop to somewhere between 80 to 90 degrees C. At this point, we gently stir the vinegar mixture in. Please be patient during the process, because we need the formed content to be settled at the bottom and the remaining soy milk floats up. A few minutes later, you will find the liquid turns clear and transparent. At this point, stop adding vinegar mixture. We don't need to use all of it. We call the middle form of tofu as douhua in Sichuan area, and douhua can be directly served with dipping sauces. To further make tofu, we need to transfer the douhua into a presser to remove extra water.
slice the tofu from 10 minutes to 1 hour based on how you want your dough to be. Look at this lovely texture, right? Since we use iced solution this time, I recommend soaking the tofu in clean water for 30 minutes before using to avoid an impossible sour taste. Now, tofu is finished. Let's enjoy cooking. <music> 